Hello, welcome to this week's video news. Miaoli Tom Blossom Festival, flight plans for little trips in Miaoli County. The Tom Blossoms in Miaoli County are in full bloom in April and May. To promote the Tom Blossom Festival, Miaoli County government will host events with townships in the county. This year's Miaoli Tom Blossom Festival has returned to nature and creativity and culture as its themes and a half-day trip will be offered, according to the Culture and Tourism Bureau of Miali County. The Culture and Tourism Bureau of Miali County organized five tone flower tours, giving the public access to enjoy the Miali's full tone blossoms in April and May. Additionally, Miali County is organizing a series of little trips of five locations that are good for seeing both flowers and fireflies. Spend a night at Taiwan's President Show office building invites foreign tourists to enjoy the President Show suite. The free experiential activity, Spend a night at Taiwan's President Show official building, comes back this year after four years. Visitors from all around the world, regardless of nationalities, are welcome to register. In the end, 10 groups will be chosen among the applicants and they will spend one night in Taiwan's highest standard presidential suite. 2019 saw the first ever spend a night at Taiwan's presidential office building events. During that time, 167 foreign groups of tourists from 33 different countries submitted registration requests. The Taiwanese public are also able to see Taiwan's highest standard presidential suite and the entire design thanks to the story reported by the lucky individuals who had access to the presidential suite. Experience foreign festival culture at 2023 e in Taipei. The Department of Information and Tourism, Taipei City Government, hosted 2023 e in Taipei, in Ba An Forest Park. The mayor of Taipei as well as representatives from Indonesia, Saudi Arabia, Brunei, Malaysia, Nigeria, and other nations stationed in Taiwan attended this year's spectacular e-offer. National Immigration Agency also offered green lucky bags and promoted the expanded overstayers voluntary departure program to the general public. In addition to wonderful stage performances, the outdoor KTV in the Grassland Farm area attracted many new immigrants to sing. Mobile Outreach Service of NIA Propaganda's Regulations to Foreign Students on Donghai University International Week. From April 25 to 26, the yearly Donghai University International Week has formally held, which featured an area for foreign cuisine and multicultural experiences. Students from Malaysia, Hong Kong, Macau, Japan, Indonesia, Vietnam, Belize, and other countries prepared delicacies and special cultural items from their hometowns and had a multicultural exchange. Mobile outreach service from the National Immigration Agency, Taichung City Service Center, compiled a list of common safety precautions that students from Hong Kong, Macau, China, and other countries living in Taiwan should be aware of and help students understand their rights of residence in Taiwan.